Yeah, so coming into this property to see it, um, it, it was in very, very rough shape. Um, it, it was like a hoarder living here. There was, you know, it actually looks a bit better now that you're seeing it. Um, they spent probably three, four days at a giant bin that they filled out with just of their personal stuff. And they've still left couches, fireplaces, three beds up, quote unquote, beds upstairs. Um, but yeah, this house was, was very rough and it, 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 you have to be able to see past that. Most people would have come in here and smelt uh, horrific smell and, and not been able to walk on some of the floors and, and would have left, right? And just not seeing the opportunity. It does take time, you know, as an investor to, you know, be able to see past that and say, okay, what's this gonna look like when it's a finished product? Um, Cause that's really, you know, uh, that's really where you're gonna make the money, right? Is, is being able to say, okay, this is a good area. The, the, the house has bones, good bones. Um, you know, it needs this, this, and this, be able to budget out what the cost of replacement for everything is, and then see what's sold in the area, right? So it's, um, you know, but get, getting back to that visualization of, of saying, you know, don't look at the stuff on the ground, look at the size of the room, um, look at the number of bedrooms, look at the bathrooms and where the plumbing is, and um, the square footage of the house, and, and the lot size, and all, all the things that, that really are, are, are much tougher to change than, you know, the drywall or the flooring or the kitchens, those are all, those are all easy, easy replacements.